fear, have no fear. Mr. Organic is here.com with my nigga Tall Guy Car Reviews, you, a.k.a. Slim. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> a.k.a. Memphis Slim. Me and calling my phone and all that, man. Come on, brother. I'm working, brother. But yeah, see the interiors is Sue Woo looking like strawberry, <laughs> strawberry uh, pie, custard pie. You know what I'm saying? Stuff they try to get on life. Yeah, come on, man. Pie, pie, pie right. was too hot. Fry only pie seats. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Burn my goddamn tongue. Well, that's what the problem. The pie was too hot. Burn my goddamn tongue. <laughs> but that's what we in, man. Got through working, man. Yeah, my toe stuck in the bottom. God damn it. God damn it. I'm talking about the bottom of the pole, man. But we here, man, working hard as we ever do. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Just coming to you live and direct. You know what I'm saying? Working, never Always. jerking. Just did the world that the AMG Biz GT, uh, GT Roaster. Yeah. Come on, man. Legendary.com, man. Y'all gonna love that. Now we cruising. You understand me? Slim, you halfway there to D Day, man. Huh? Halfway there, man. So, the Cali? Yeah. Yeah. It's crazy. Big time. You ready for that, man? <laughs> Got no choice, brother. I ain't mean, a big mother, sick and swim. <laughs> big time. For sure. Big time. Great white, man. Well, it has to be done, man. It has to be done, man. I'd be a big, uh, big uh, hypocrite if I didn't. Right, right. <laughs> that's, the, that's the cold, man. The top of the moon cold. That's what we gotta be done, man. That's what we do. We feast upon adversity. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? For sure. And you know, the crazy part is, man, for a lot of people, uh, you know, when you whether it's basketball, whether it's opening a business, uh, whether it's any sport or anything like that, you, everybody has a window on when they can capitalize on things at their peak moments. Or, you know, I'm not saying this is our peak right now, but yeah. I'm saying that, you know, we all have a window. Yeah, opportunities right? are scarce right? in this world. Yeah, for sure. Well. So you got to be very opportunistic, but at the same time, you don't want to force the issue. But at the same time, you got to know and keep in mind that, you know, understand LeBron James is – and it's 16, 17 season, brother. You know what I mean? Like, everything comes to an end. You're even, right. Even the best things in the he world. He ain't making the playoffs this year, man. I wish he was, though. Best. I like him. You know what I mean? But uh, and I like, I like what he's doing yeah, for the I culture. Like, I, like him, I like him. Yeah, that part. For sure. But the thing is, is everybody has a window. You know what I mean? Right. And it's, right now, I'm just trying to capitalize on what I can while I can throughout this whole YouTube stuff. And uh, right. me, as a seven-time felon, it's uh, scary for me, to be honest with y'all, because... This is the best thing that ever happened to me in my life. No by question. Far. Yeah. You know, G Squad, y'all the best, Organic Nation, y'all the best, man. And um, I just know that I have to capitalize while I can, when I can. No so question. So I'm going out here solely for that purpose, nothing else. Nothing else. You know, um, and it's, it's scary, though, because, you know, it's, it's shit, it's the unknown. Yeah. You know what I mean? You're going to them dark depths. Yeah, think about it. Like, the, the, a lot of y'all probably got a girlfriend right now who you probably deep down, like, yeah, man, I don't know. You know what I mean? But you stay with it because you know. Yeah, or and that even people, like I get Tina Turner, you know what I mean? It's a big toxic relationship. Yeah. But the thing was, though, is they know each other. So a lot of people stick to what they know. Even if it's a bad thing, they still Yeah, it's like people have jobs. They have jobs they don't like. They hate for everybody sure. at the job. They hate what they're doing for a living. Yeah. But they have a job. You know what I'm saying? Absolutely. Even though they know there's not something they want to do. Yeah. But it's comfortability. I have a job. You know yeah. what I mean? Security. But at the end of the day, when you let that go and you go find something you really love, it's a different type of feeling. Yeah. So I, it, I it, it's damn sure scary. Yeah, Will Smith said, I was watching uh, something with him last night, and he was like, uh, get rid of security uh, and don't live life for security, live life for experience. Right. You know, life experiences and whatever like that. He, he pretty much in a nutshell, what he was saying was, you know, just take leaps of faith, man, and stuff like that. Stuff I tell you all the time, stuff that I live by. No and question. I've been doing that's what got me where I'm at today, but... You know, when you come from where we come from and you finally get a little something, I was talking to my brother Jeremy about this thing, is when you get a little something, you be scared to take any yeah. any steps because whatever you get, you kind of want to hold tight to your hold chest. Hold tight. You know what I mean? Um, but that's, you can't grab But things, you ain't going to be able to go. You got a handful of pennies. You can't fly standing on the ground, you know, man. Relax. You can't do it, man. Yep. So, the guy like the them. flight brothers. Right. You know what I mean? They're, they're fly, just get a bunch of different things, crash, get yeah. back up there. You know, you gotta, you they gotta, invented flying, the right boys. You know yeah. what I'm saying? You gotta think about that. You gotta be one of the ones. 100%. To be an iconic person in life, you, you have to do, you know what I'm saying? Take yep. big risks, big jumps. So that's what we on right now, man. Thanks. And we like to just give you all this talk sometimes to let y'all know. One, you gotta take a little call. Yeah, get back need transactions, you know what I'm saying? Time. Just, you know, I had to make, make sure they chance for the millions. <laughs> but yeah, we cruise, man. Like I said, we have these organic talks, y'all. Sometimes just to let y'all know how real this is, how real we are at this shit, man. Like, you know how much we share with y'all. Yeah, we give y'all the full dialogue. Yeah, 
know what I mean? It's all on the line. It's all in like playing poker. Goon chips is all the way up to the neck. You know what I mean? Yeah, my friend. All in. That's Trying true. to double up though. You know what I mean? It's either, it's either win big or you lose big. Any way it go. Yeah. Nipsey also said the best one day one of the songs is a song called Bigger Than Life by Nipsey also. What'd he say, brother? He said, uh, he said, he said, ball till we fall. Fuck how the story ends. Right. He was pretty much the same. Give it everything you got. Don't think about how it's going to end. Just give it every single thing you got, and that should be more than enough, pretty much, is what he was saying. Then. Always will be. For sure. You know what I mean? Um, and if it ain't, then it just wasn't God's plan for you to succeed. No question that. about it. You know, because I gave basketball everything I had. You gave basketball everything I had, but everything. it ain't what we're doing right now. It ain't what we're doing right now. But were we great at it? Yes. Were we right. failures at it because we didn't go to the most NBAs and get to everything we want to get to the bag and all that? Uh huh. No. No. You know? The story was written, and, 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 and it, and it and it's a, a very, you know, uh, important part of our lives, and, and the people know, you know. Yeah, when absolutely. Everybody can't go to the top. Mm -hmm. At least you, you know what I'm saying, you're on that ride, though, you know. Absolutely. And that's what we're doing right now. We, but we're going to the top on this, though. No question. Ain't no, and, and ain't no, we got uh, no choice. Ain't no otherwise on this. We yeah. winning, and it's big. And we want y'all to go every step of the way and watch this. And y'all enjoy this, and we tell y'all. We're gonna take big risks and we're gonna enjoy the big rewards and we're gonna lose big sometimes too. That's part of it. Yeah. You know what I mean? That's part of it, but part of the game. We ain't gonna sit here and just be stagnant. We ain't gonna give we ain't gonna just spoon feed y'all. We're gonna give y'all some legendary content, some Absolutely. legendary experiences. Because the harder we go, the harder you can go. Yep. You know what I'm saying? So shit. We motivating ourselves at the same time motivating y'all, man. Yeah, man. So we pushing ourselves to the brink too, just yeah. like how we push y'all. So don't be afraid to take, don't be afraid to do what we do, man. You know what I'm saying it might not be YouTube, might be something, might be basketball, it might be at your job, it might be your own, you know, your own business. Whatever it is, go hard at it. Absolutely. Don't deprive yourself of greatness by being timid or complacent. Just go. Fuck it. You're gonna die anyway. Yeah, how would you rather die? Would you rather die doing something you didn't want to do or something you love doing? Damn yeah, right. A coward dies a thousand deaths, that's what they say. Remember that, man. A coward dies a thousand deaths, man. You die every day holding it hard. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, a real warrior, a real gargoyle, you die one time, nigga, and this legendary statues is made, man. See that right there, B? Minnesota history sitting right on time. I'm going to be up in there like this. Statue of the gargoyle. Up in the history center, baby. We don't make history. <laughs> I know I always find shit right on time when it happens, but that's how it is. Be that's historical. Crazy. I know, right? Yeah. Be historical, man. Leave something behind. It's all about a legacy. Yeah. Ain't gonna, all that money, all that fame, all that's cool. What you gonna leave behind? What nutrients you gonna leave on this earth that's gonna keep it well, going and growing? You have people lives. Ain't nothing, somebody told me, ain't nothing more powerful in this world than influence. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If you influence people, good or bad, whatever it is, that's the most powerful thing on this earth. Yeah. That religion is based off of, that would like, Brands, all that is based off influence. Well, that's just is, in a good way or a bad way. Yep, nothing's more important than influence. So, we have an opportunity to influence a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? And our thing is self motivation, going hard, leaps of faith. That's basically what we're pushing into people. So, we want y'all to use that to your advantage, man. Absolutely. And that would keep us going. Yep. You know what I mean, shit. It'd be easy just to stop now. I got Corvettes living penthouses, jewelry, I have all the women I want. All the good perfumes and colognes I got, you know what I'm saying? Different sides and draws every day, different type of foods I eat. I could be complacent and be cool, but that ain't where I'm trying to be. I'm trying to be at the top. Yeah. Right? You know what Absolutely. I'm saying? Take care of your family, man. Yeah. Everybody, it ain't about us no more. We, we didn't we did a lot for ourselves. For sure. I want to make it comfortable for, you know, my family. Yeah. And also, at the same time, like I said, it's deep, 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 deep inspiration and motivation I'm trying to give y'all. The bigger we go, the more we do, the more we can motivate you, you know what I mean? Yeah, and I think, I mean, just think about it too. People see me from the time I started my channel. Crazy. To doing car views where I couldn't even drive them. Couldn't even drive outside yeah. in the cold with that same motherfucking jacket on. Yeah, right. Cold, zipped all the way up to your neck. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Cold, you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, I was just, like, damn. Yeah, that's true. And then living in an apartment. Yep. Hellcat parked outside, outside. On the snow, in the snow with a legendary rap on it. No question about it. Big, I remember, I remember when you first got the card, that was great. I remember you just getting the rap, like, man, I'm going to put the rap on the ground. How much that cost? Damn, you going to pay that? <laughs> yeah, I'm doing it. I got to do it. Yep. It's going to be legendary. Ain't nobody got it. I'm like, man, let's do it. And I understand, too, at that time, that was that was three car payments almost. Yeah, you, you and this is yeah, when you just got the car. You already could afford the car. You yeah. could definitely afford that rap. Yeah. But you did it. 
Because I had a vision. Yeah, a vision that you invested in yourself. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? People want everything handed to them, man. You got to invest in yourself. The more you put in yourself, the more people put into you also. People just got to know that. Yeah, you got to live in yourself long before anybody else. Right? Straight up. You got to put that vision out there. Believe before becoming is real. Absolutely. So now look, you know what I mean? Now I'm about to take another leap. Now you're taking a big goddamn I'm tsunami, man. Leap. Leap. Yeah. yeah, big Niagara Falls leap. Big time. <laughs> yeah, no question about that big, big uh, Dubai top of the tower yeah, type, yeah. all the way to the highest point in the world type. Yeah. Yeah, no parachute. No. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, yeah, it's, but it's got to be done, though, man. Got to be done. You know what I'm saying? Man? I, I have the vision like I had before. You just got to trust it, you know? Got to trust it. But it, to be honest, man, it'd be easy to sit here, man, and so be like, hey, man, why I got this nice little check game, man? I'm good. You know what I'm saying? I got my Hellcat, got my truck. Let's not push it. You yep. know what I mean? But oh, yeah, um, I know I'm not gonna grow exponentially like I wanna grow like that. Just like the track hog. The track hog was something I bought was a huge leap of faith, and at that time I was terrified to get that. Right. It was hundred six thousand dollars almost. Big petrified. Uh, but seventeen sixty a month. I two hundred some dollars I was paying two thousand dollars a month for that car. <laughs> wasn't at that time I, I couldn't say 2001 was just something that was just easy breeze no way you know what I mean that's for damn sure but I trust the vision of what I could do with my YouTube channel and that's why I made every video you know the mankind that you can make with it yeah right and then I got rid of it you know what I mean After business time. big business man yeah. Yeah. and we did that over and over again too negative equity you got a lot of stuff right. there that y'all just don't know but either way it goes you can't stop taking these lips away because if you stop taking them that's when you, that's the day you will stop growing Yep, and that's the day. Yep, you're gonna stop growing and you're gonna start dying. You know what I mean? Yep. So, just like people, when they stop working, they retire. Yep. You know, a lot of times people die shortly after that, man. You gotta find your purpose in life, man. Find your purpose in life and then go for it. Once you find it and you truly believe that's what you're here for, go hard at it. Absolutely. Give it everything you got. Don't never give up on yourself and don't ever give up on your dreams. Facts. There's two things you can't do in this life. Because if you give up on you, Who's gonna have you? Yeah. Who's gonna take care of you? Who's people don't you? believe it. Most people don't believe in you anyway. And even if somebody say they do, what are they doing to show you that they believe in you? It's easy to say, yeah, I believe in you. Are you sure? Who put who putting the battery in your back? Who waking up with you? Who invested in you? The only people that really believe in you. People can say all day because people ain't stupid. They see somebody who work pretty hard. They can be like, yeah, I can believe in you. They can tell you that. Whoa, what's that really doing for me, nigga? You know what I'm saying? So. Don't let that don't let that be the catalyst to your greatness. You have to turn your own button on. You gotta turn your own button on and just go. Because as much as y'all believe in us, you think that y'all would have ever known who we were or followed us if we didn't believe in us first. Right. If you didn't feel this real energy we give y'all, this confidence, this motivation, this this you know what I'm saying, this ambition that we got, this passion. If it wasn't real, we exude this to y'all, y'all would not be watching us. And y'all smart, man. Y'all know who fake it. Y'all know the difference. Big time. I know the difference. The thing so. is, is who, who else? I was to keep it all the way just pure with y'all, man. Who else on YouTube really come from the pits like we do? Who really came from that, man? Who really is showing y'all here's where I came from and been with us that whole time? And you can check it out. You can do your research. And these dudes really came from that. Yeah. They just saying it to just sell something to you. Not at all. They really came from that. We know give y'all the good, the bad, the ugly. We don't have to tell y'all certain stuff and make it look more legendary and more super. And we bigger and better than everybody. We can easily do that, but we don't do that. We give you all the organic realness, man. So y'all should take that in stride. But make sure, man, I'm going to keep reiterating that. Make sure you know who you are. I'm saying believe in yourself. Never give up on yourself or your goals. That's all I ask of you. Stay true to yourself. Stay true to yourself, man. Stay real with you and your peoples. You understand me, motherfucker? Bitch! I'm up out of here, man. Tall guy gone, man. We in the big Ram Reason keeping it greasy, motherfucker. Organiclifestyle.com. Damn.